This is Rock Canyon High School's workout facility. For juniors and seniors in the fire science class, it's more than just building the body. It's a, a very physical job. Fire departments are hiring professional strength coaches. Nice! They're building trust. We got this. We always work out together, so we like cheer each other mm -hmm. on. When they come in here day one, they don't know each other. A couple weeks into it, they're like family. Ready? Buck up! Doing good. I knew that being a firefighter is very physically demanding, and it certainly has been so far. Minute 33, hey, not bad. A lot of them want to be firefighters and are really serious about doing this. This is hands-on experience. Experience that will serve them well, regardless of their post-graduation path. So technically, you really only need a high school diploma. Um, but nowadays, it's getting a lot more competitive, so more people are starting to go to college before becoming a firefighter. Go! Coming here and uh, doing this program and learning all the new things about it. There you go. Keep feeding it. There you go. Kind of the techniques and all that, it's really inspired me. The training at school is valuable. Look up. The training with current firefighters from South Metro and elsewhere. Being able to train with them once a month. I think is hugely important in this program. This is the Littleton Fire Training Tower. Some guys are on shift, some guys are off duty, but they're here to help you guys out. It's where the classroom training meets real world scenarios. We are going to do car fires, hose movement stuff. We're going to do some more forceful entry. The third group is going to be search. And it's darker than Dickens in there. One of their younger instructors uh, going on four years here in a couple of weeks has walked in their boots. Uh, I actually have this program to thank for it. All right, Julia. Chase McDaniels was himself a fire science student at Rock Canyon. I realized I fell in love with it just from a from a year in high school. So he often returns to give back to the program that's given him so much. I see this as kind of it was my golden ticket into the fire service. If you can't see anything on your knees. It's a career that's built on trust. We have uh, some really, some really good days and some really bad days where you run on, on difficult, you know, intense and critical calls. Victor, 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 Victor! We're gonna have to drag him out. Why do we go into buildings that are on fire? Search for people. Search for people. That's the most important thing. I found the doorway. A toxic environment, a burning environment. I need to know that my officer and my my engineer and my firefighters, my family, really, you know, they have my back. More than any skill they learn. We all want to go home and we all want to serve our community. They learn how to live to work another day on the job. Best job in the world. <laughs>